Welcome back to the vlogs. We are in Jamaica. In Jamaica right now it is late we got in earlier this morning I'm here with my best friend Naomi I was literally in the Bahamas last week and now I'm in Jamaica and I'm so happy to get to start off the new year with some travels because honestly nothing makes me more happy than traveling like it makes me so happy so I'm really excited to be here the weather today was really rainy I didn't get to show you guys a lot because there was just so much going on um, but I wanted to hop on here and just kind of start off this vlog. We're only here till Saturday. I'm definitely going to be vlogging the whole trip for you guys as always. And I'll show you around more tomorrow um, and the rest of the days. But today I was a little bit off the camera because I just had a lot going on. We were dealing with hotel and checking in and like exploring and all that stuff. And then it started raining. It was like raining on and off all day. So and that kind of sucked. But Crossing my fingers, according to the weather app, tomorrow is supposed to be better, so I really hope it is because we're actually trying to tan. I didn't get to tan a single moment in the Bahamas except the last day because it was actually clear skies, but the sun wasn't like really that strong. So I'm hoping here, the sun, it's supposed to be hotter than it was in the Bahamas, so I'm really hoping that we get to tan a little bit. But we're just here on a very chill trip. Nothing crazy is going on. We're just relaxing, hanging out at the beach. It's all-inclusive. We made sure to book an all-inclusive resort so we can just eat. <laughs> We literally ordered so much room service. We are so tired. We don't want to go down and get dinner somewhere um, So we just ordered a bunch of room service and we just ordered more cheese fries It's not like we're gonna be in the bikini on the beach tomorrow. Forget about that. I'm about to hop in the shower I was just finishing some work on my laptop as you guys saw um, and then watching like YouTube I was watching America's 10 most viewed America's Got Talent auditions in 2021 and it's really good. So I just had that playing in the background and then working on my laptop and now I'm about to shower, take off all this makeup. It just, I actually didn't do it that long ago but my face just feels gross from traveling all day. Early morning tomorrow we wanted to get up early, get some coffee, get some breakfast and start our day off. I don't know, I was kind of thinking we could do some water excursions. We'll see kind of what we feel like doing. They, the resort has like water excursions we could do and things like that. Um, we were gonna do a massage today, but then we decided not to because the weather was really bad So we're like, what should we do in the evening? Um, and then we did end up getting a massage We just kind of chilled and hung out and I caught up with my best friend and we talked and all that stuff I'll see you guys in the morning Love you <laughs> just had breakfast and now we are off to the beach down there so excited ignore the mess behind me but this is what I'm wearing always my easy slides because they're just the most comfortable have this like sarong blue bikini top and bottom sunny sunscreen everything is in the beach bag
Okay, I'm getting ready right now. We were just at the beach all morning. I just showered. Now I'm in a rush to get ready because we are gonna go get t t tattoos. <laughs> I know if you guys watched my last vlog from uh, the Bahamas, I got like a little heart tattoo right up here. I don't know if you could see it. But it's really small and not really like so noticeable, but it's still like noticeable when I have my hair up. And I think it's really cute. And my bestie and I were like, we've always wanted to, wait. I feel like we got tattoos together before. She's in the shower getting ready right now. But I think we had, when I lived in New York, we got tattoos together. Not matching ones, but just like went in together. And we're definitely in a tattoo mood. I don't know why. But we're like, what's like something fun we could do together that doesn't involve like partying and drinking and like a good memory like that. And I'm like, well, let's go get little small tattoos again. So. We're about to go do that. We got, we kept asking like the locals here, like where do people go? Because we wanted to go to like a legit good spot. And there isn't like really like a lot of places online when we looked. Um, I feel like it's more like you just know if you live here. So we got recommended this place a bunch of times and it's literally like a, what, 10 minute walk from our resort. So. We're gonna go there, we schedule an appointment, and we're getting ready now to go. Anyways, I just wanted to fill you guys in because I feel like I haven't, whoa. I feel like I haven't really talked to you guys today yet and yesterday. It's more of a chill trip. We're just hanging out, having a good time. So there's not really much to talk about. I'm just kind of like showing you what we're doing. We're at the beach literally all morning. We have food, went to the beach, chilled. Um, a little bit of bronzer. Love my hourglass palette. My hair's a mess, so I need to fix that. We went to the tattoo spot, and we just did not feel safe in there. It didn't. It wasn't really clean, and with tattoos, you just have to be so careful. So. Even though we were so excited and this place was like recommended by several people, we just didn't feel safe and we couldn't risk it because it's one of those things like if you get a tattoo there and something happens, it's like all on you. Um, we don't live here. It's not like we can, you know, come back and see something. So even just the waiting area was like not clean at all. So we were just scared to risk it and have maybe something happen. But I'm gonna go get some iced tea, some coffee for Naomi and I don't know, probably just walk around the resort, chill, take pics. <laughs> like, what else are we to do? <laughs>
had the best day at the beach. It's from my Bahamas trip. I literally went in with clear skin, left with like three bumps on my face. The sun is like setting. It's absolutely beautiful. My hair is so wild. Do you see the pieces up here? I kept trying to fix it. It's just not cooperating. But I'm about to shower, get ready, go to dinner soon. Just hang out. I don't know what we're doing. We literally have been just chilling, go with the flow every single day. Nothing crazy. Today was like almost 90 degrees. It was so hot. We came back to the room for a second to take a break and like cool off in the AC because we got so hot, but so I'm about to go shower and then go eat again. The eating has not stopped. I don't know if we're doing, we're debating between Italian. There's an Italian restaurant, Asian restaurant, and a, like a hibachi restaurant. So we're trying to figure out what we're going to do. Maybe we're going to check out two because last night we went to dinner to do two different spots. I went to breakfast and I didn't notice that whoever sat before me spilled like coffee all over the seat and didn't clean it up. The workers also, I guess, didn't see it and clean it up. So I sat in it and I just ruined the whole outfit. So I went upstairs to change. So I go back and apparently they changed the chair, but I still didn't trust the whole situation. I felt like something's about to happen again. So I took like a white cloth and like cleaned the chair that they apparently swapped out. It seemed... Okay, but then I still put the cloth on the chair and then I sat on the chair and then I got up and the fucking cloth was wet again with brown spots My shorts that I just changed into have brown spots on them again. Not as bad as literally this. This is a fucking disaster. Look at this Embarrassing walking through the resort with like literally those shorts on it looks so bad We've Got our COVID test because we leave tomorrow. And we have to get COVID test. They came back negative So happy about that. That means we can fly home
be done. So, whoa, Naomi, we're literally on top of it. Where is it? Precision. Where is it? Not exactly. I wouldn't say precision. Oh, oh my gosh, Naomi. Wait, make sure it's not behind us. <laughs> oh shit, it's deep here. Straight ahead, honey. Straight ahead. <laughs> Grab it. Yay! Oh. Our little kayak adventure. We're trying to walk it off a little bit. This was gonna be the time where I was gonna go get more ice cream, but then I realized that I really could not put anything down my body anymore or I'm gonna throw up. I'm so uncomfortably full. We're about to check out the hot tubs open because it's actually so nice out and the hot tub earlier was packed and we were like, this would be really fun if it's empty and we could just come chill and like, oh, it's empty, fire. We might just go change and chill in the hot tub. The pools and the hot tub, everything here is open like 24 seven, so you really could go in at any time, which is really cool and nice. I think I'm gonna have to go get a new camera because you know all the little fuzzy lines that happen randomly? I think my camera's broken, so I might have to just go buy another one when I get back. This one lasted me a while, so I'm not complaining. It lasted longer than I thought it would, considering all the travels and things we've been through together. But yeah. Got a semi-tan, I'm a little red, as you could tell. Especially right here, my shoulders, always. I put on sunscreen, but it was hot. We did the kayak again um, before it closed down, before it got dark, and literally just stuffed our fucking faces with food because we paid for all-inclusive and we sure got it. So, I ate so much. Um, that's about it, that's literally, we just chilled and hung out and had the best time ever, so. Now I think we're gonna get ready for the hot tub, that sounds really fun. See you guys in a second. 